Hi, today I want to show you this script that I made and it's a little bit, it's a modification of a script that I made some time ago and let me see what it is. Here I got uh, what you can uh, write to your students and uh, you have different email to, for different students and different uh, um, uh, different things to, to uh, send to, to each student. But this time, this is not a test, uh, a different test, but it's just the result, the result of a test. So let's suppose we made a... Uh, let's suppose that we made a form with Google Form. And so we go in Google Form and we got our our form and you know that we can collect the data from a from a form uh, with an Excel file and so you go in the responses and then you get this uh, click on this icon here and you will get the forms with all the for example the email of the student and the result etc and then you can go and uh, here we don't have the email etc because this is not complete but suppose it is complete then you download it you will download it as an excel file and save it and then you will have a, an excel file like this um, this is a form where we have different questions and answers and here is the score uh, that in Italian is punteggio and here we have the email address of the students and here are the name of the students so we are going to use uh, pandas and to read the, the data here and uh, and okay we're gonna write the data into this data frame with red excel uh, so we are going to write the file then for each um, each email here in the as you can see we got these two emails here for each uh, field on in this column it will append the uh, the string it will append the address we don't need this We'll append the address uh, into th this uh, list of emails that are called the destinatari. Then we have the name under the column nome. So here we get the different names and that will go here. And then we have the score that in Italian is punteggio and it will be listed into this list. Then I'm gonna create a um, scheme of the body or the letter where I say dear and the name goes here with the mail and here got the mail your score is this one okay this is the template of the email and then in this one I am gonna do a uh, sorry something that I okay this was something that I made for a random exercise it doesn't need this in in this one so we get just the message and the, sol the solution here this we don't need it either um, yeah okay we just need a message and for each uh, for each name that we collected, we're gonna modify the template here. The template here, and that is, you know, uh, we will call tracha equals schema dot format, and I will substitute the name with the S because. The, the S is each name in the column of the names and then we have the email of each one of this and then the score so 
uh, we'll replace your name, email and score and then we will append the all the, all the bodies for each student with their names and the scores into this list called messaggi. Then I'm gonna that mm, this is gonna save the different messages that could be useful for me into this solution and um, yeah let's leave it like this and then we don't need this it's gonna open this file where we have saved on our hard drive all the all the email that we sent and then this is to send the email and we got um, that for every message uh, we're gonna send an email from my your my um, the Gmail SMTP and from my email to the email of each one with a different um, body that is message here and then we quit the server so we just need to and this is the the graphical user interface to even modify something or send our emails now I'll let you show how uh, the last thing that you will need is a password uh, this password comes from email and I made you uh, I showed it you go into manage your Google account go in security mm, then go into sign into Google app password and then you put in your password once you're here you select the app like um, mail select the device from where you want to start the script you say Windows computer if it's a computer then generate the password then you copy the password that will be generated and you will put the password into here into like I showed you into here you're gonna copy and paste it uh, it's not of course this one this is to hide my password and so once you did this you just you just You just run this and then you go and send me and it all will work. Now there could be some something not working because I don't have the email here or some other stuff. But the script that I will leave in the in the in my post will work perfectly. Thank you.